Caring, commitment, challenge. Those three words represent the values and mission of Iowa Western Community College. Established in 1966, Iowa Western has built a reputation as Southwest Iowa's premier educational institution. With more than 18,000 alumni living and working in Iowa Western's seven county service area, Iowa Western contributes to the economic, cultural, and social vitality of those communities. Helping Iowa Western achieve the success, the tireless work of many volunteers and boosters, putting forth their time and resources supporting Iowa Western's mission. In 1999, the Iowa Western Foundation began honoring individuals for their personal, professional, and community efforts by supporting Iowa Western Community College with the Investment in Excellence Award. Iowa Western Community College proudly presents the 2010 Investment in Excellence Award to John and Linda Allen. Well, John and Linda Allen's association with the college uh, goes back many years uh, before I even came to Iowa Western 17 years ago. And uh, they've always been great supporters of the college, great contributors to the scholarship funds. And so they continue to provide their their personal support and, and leadership uh, to help the college uh, advance as we move into the future. The fact that they're receiving the Excellence uh, Award this evening is well deserved and uh, really is in appreciation for what they've done for the college and for the students uh, that attend Iowa Western Community College. John and Linda's investment in excellence begins with their commitment to each other. The high school sweethearts from Waterloo, Iowa married 40 years ago. Since then, they have always been a team. You know, if John needed support at home while he was out working, he needed the kids to be taken care of, uh, Linda was there to support him. If John had an idea that, uh, you know, maybe they should get involved in something, uh, Linda was there to support him. If Linda had an idea of something that she wanted to support, uh, John was always there. I think uh, as a team, uh, they were able to do things that a lot of people uh, don't have the opportunity to do. Their first interest, building a home and family. In 1978, they moved to Council Bluffs to build their family, a business, and a community. Community is only as good as the, the people that live in it. And, and, and the community changes based on, on what people want to have happen in their community. You know, people like John and Linda made a commitment to the community beyond just living here and just working here and beyond raising their family here. They made a commitment to be a volunteer, to be a supporter of whatever happened in the community. They were there. A community can't grow without those people. And they made a commitment that when they came to the community, they were going to make a difference. People like that are hard to find. John and Linda's investment to the Council Bluffs community began with a business, High V, where John served as a store director for 25 years. Linda and John uh, have worked very hard all their lives. The store director at High V is not an easy job, and. Uh, starts out, he started out sacking groceries, carrying groceries out to the cars and uh, worked his way up to being on the board of directors for hy -Vee. The Allen support to Council Bluffs didn't stop at just the growth of their business and their family. Instead, their support expanded by giving part of themselves to the community. When you go through the list of things that he's been involved with and is still involved with, you just have to remember that each one of those things is a big deal to him. By volunteering, to serving as board members, the Allens contributed to several organizations in the Council Bluffs area. Some of those organizations include Children's Square USA, the Council Bluffs Airport Authority, the Spirit of Courage, Juvenile Diabetes Research Foundation, and to Iowa Western Community College, where the Allens supported their belief in the value of an educated community. Whether it be at a university level, college level, community college level, trade, school. That's how individuals expand their knowledge and their abilities to perform different tasks and perhaps even tasks they didn't even believe they could have performed. And that all comes through education. Another part of the education is most of the students that graduate from Iowa Western Community College or any community college, they stay within that area and they, they get jobs within that area, they raise families within that area, 
they contribute to the economic well-being of a community. The Allens have made significant contributions to educate their community by supporting Iowa Western Community College, serving on the foundation board and the board of trustees. While on the board, they were instrumental in bringing a new aviation and entrepreneurial center to Iowa Western. Together, they have been involved in the Black Tie Harvest for Scholarship, chairing the event in 2004. Through it all, John and Linda worked as a team. It's kind of like a piece of material. There's a warp and there's a weave. And John is the weave and she's the warp. Holds everything together. And they have all of these threads of their interest that are there. But to truly understand this team's investment to excellence, we look back to August 2005, when John was diagnosed with stage 4 esophageal cancer. His prognosis, a 15% survival rate. But John and Linda's determination didn't waver. John's hard-headed. He would not accept no for an answer. He spent his whole life never accepting no for an answer. I mean, he got a very bad answer there. I mean, very bad. And it would have been very easy to roll up the sidewalks and say, well, that's it, see ya. And he said no. And it is that personal drive that John has that, that pulled him through. And there were times when that was not enough. And Linda was there to help kind of keep, get him standing on his feet and saying, okay, John, we can do this, you know? And so they are a team. Fighting for his life, John went through a year of invasive treatment filled with chemotherapy, radiation, and surgery. Today, doctors cannot detect any reoccurrence of the cancer. And John says through that year, he found strength in his wife, his children, Trisha and Joel, his grandchildren, his friends, and his community, a team invested to excellence. John and Linda were there to make a difference and uh, their commitment to our community is, is obviously has made a difference in all the things they've done and their commitment to the uh, college has is, is, uh, been amazing. Uh, they, they want that community college to be a, a better place not only for today but in the future. It's tantalizingly refreshing to see those kinds of people together helping, helping themselves, helping each other, and helping us. I mean, it, 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 it's, it's a privilege to know them. With family, friends, and a strong community educated by Iowa Western Community College, John and Linda together have made an investment in excellence. Council Bluffs has been very good to us over the years. They've always been very friendly. They've um, supported our business. And so we just want to give back to the community any way we can. Whatever small part we can do through volunteering or supporting, it may help someone at the college um, get the job of their dreams, maybe become a leader in the community maybe just become a leader in their own family. I'd say follow your dream. It's hard work, it takes time, but you know when you just put your head down and plain go to work and pursue a task and you accomplish it, it sure makes you feel good. The 2010 Investment in Excellence Award, John and Linda Allen.